Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of our Fire Emblem Three Houses playthrough that we are doing. I just went ahead and finished off two of the boring missions, uh, and that is where we're going to pick up. So we're going to hop right into instructing our guys and see what we can do. I know a couple of them... Yeah, a couple of them were able to train up. I know Bernadetta, D, she did get uh, MVP during one of our previous videos. So she's 100% maxed out. Um, so I think for her, we're going to actually throw a bunch into authority. Perfect. That gets her up to a B+. Plus. And then the rest of it is going to go into Faith. That is three perfects on that one. That is great. All right, we have Yuritsa here. Uh, I mean, I don't see any issues with him, so I think we're just going to go ahead and throw authority into him as well. We already got a perfect on the first one there. And then two greats and two goods, so that was pretty decent. All right, we do have Anna here. Um, you know what? Let's finish her budding talent. Let's see what that gets us. Okay, so we have... Oh, the ability to pass. Okay, so that's really good. So what the pass allows us to do is we can move through any units. That means both enemies and allies alike. So that is actually pretty useful. And then the rest will go into authority all right we do have yuri here as well he doesn't have he doesn't need magic uh so we're just gonna throw his into reason that is two perfects in a row for yuri plus a great all right there's good and then two goods all right um i think that's everyone we use oh we do have a couple for ferdinand so we will use him we're gonna do the same thing we're gonna throw it all into authority perfect he's up at c plus now and i think that's all we really want so we're just gonna let the auto instructor finish it off for whatever two they choose constance and hubert okay make sure the goals are still good yeah faith and authority uh bernadetta faith and authority Okay, Petra flying. Oh, that's right. Yeah, we were going to get her to try and be a dark flyer. Okay, hopefully we can try that out. Mm, Lysithia, we need a little bit more in Lance, so I'm actually going to swap her just to Lance. Leone should be fine. She's level 29, so she can't level up yet. Anna's level 29. She's able to use magic though, so I want her to be able to use some better some better guys so we'll get authority going. Yeah, the rest of them are good. All right, what does this week have in store for us? Oh, something on the 15th. Yeah. It's Happy's birthday. We're going to go ahead and give her some flowers. Why not? Saturday has arrived. Let's see how well they do. Now, we've had them do flying for the entire game, and they haven't gotten anything above a good. And look, they're both at B plus and B. Still aren't able to fly properly. Alright, so we have Lysithia with her lance up. Thank you so much. Yep, so these were the two quest that I did off camera just because there wasn't really any story they weren't too hard we just kind of steamrolled through them got a couple battalions there so we are going to check the certifications now because the master certifications are a bit harder to come by I will be resetting if we don't get it Oh, shoot. Did she... Did we already... We did. Oh. All right. Edelgard already has her master class. We're just going to have to change her over. Ferdinand, on the other hand... 
Oh, he, I don't, I think we messed up with him. Yeah, we should have been focusing on some other stuff. So I think he will just end up staying as a bishop for the rest of this playthrough. Bernadetta does have the ability. 88% chance. I don't see her failing. Perfect, okay. So we do have Bernadetta as a Grimori now. And her defense is the only thing that raised. We will swap her over. Petra. Okay. So we can make her a Dark Flyer, which decreases her magic by just a little bit, potentially, but increases dex and speed and allows for Black Tome Fair. That basically means plus five attack when using black magic. Um... Oh, this is really cool. Uh, if unit is hit with a magic attack during enemy phase, it grants plus three to all stats until the end of the next turn. So I think we will have her become a dark flyer. I don't see any issues with this. Especially since it was a guaranteed level up as well. She has success. We will need to get her a new battalion, however, but that is fine with me. I don't think anyone else. Oh, maybe with Yuri. Oh, there's a 31% chance. What do we get with it, though? Sword Fair and Black Tome Fair? What do we have? Oh, what is a special? He has a special trickster. That is interesting. But that also decreases a couple of his things. Let me check out what he currently has going on for him here with Swordmaster. Oh, I don't think I can. Ooh. Um. What does Swordmaster have? It has Sword Fair and Crit. We're currently sitting at 27 strength. We could have him become a mortal savant, or at least attempt. Is it worth it? His movement goes up. We're gonna try it. We're gonna try it. I'm gonna save real quick. And we are gonna try and level, or rather advance his class. Oh, we can also do Lysithia too. How is she faring? Ooh, hers is... Hers is pretty tricky as well. So we have two that we can try here. Let's try Lysithia's first. She has a higher chance. And she succeeds. Okay, perfect. So how advanced classes work, or how advancing classes work, is it is perfect. guaranteed uh, to advance on a certain day. So if she were to fail, you can't reset to try and get her to pass. It'll just be the same. So we know she passes, but let's try Yuri. Does Yuri pass here or does he fail? And he passes. And he passes with a 31% chance to do so. His magic goes up by three. We're not gonna let him rank up just yet, mainly because I still need him to master the Swordmaster class. Uh, how far along is he? I know there's a way to check it. Hmm. I know there's a place to check it, but it's not there. So I am gonna go ahead and quickly uh, explore, just do the normal things, and I will cut to here. So that was a quick cut. Uh, we are back to instructing the students once again. I just went ahead and went through all the boring tasks no one wants to watch anymore because I've done it a hundred of, you know, hundreds of times. So we are back to here. Same thing. We are just going to focus on authority for the majority of our students here. That was a pretty good one for Edelgard. A bunch of greats and a perfect getting us five things we could do there. 
we're going to do the same thing with Bernadetta here. It's three greats. No perfect, but she did get five or four greats in a row. Dorothea, Dorothea. We want her. I think it would just do Lance. I think that's the best thing to do, if I remember correctly. Unfortunately, they were all good, so we do not get any bonuses there. Petra's already a dark flyer, so that is pretty good, actually. Uh, so we're just gonna focus on her reason magic. All goods and one gray, and that's not bad. We do have our wyvern lord here. Same thing, we're just gonna focus on authority. We got one perfect, two perfects, three perfects, and a good four out of five were perfect. That's gotta be some sort of record, I bet. All right, we have Leone here. We are gonna work on the horse here. Oh, I got my cat coming to say hi. She just jumped on the back of my chair there. All right, we have one more. One more, one more. I mean, I guess we can attempt We can attempt. Let's let's work on Lance. We'll try and get him using lances and horses. So we'll have him focus on horses now. I completely forgot the males in this game cannot be the Grimori class. It is a female specific class. All right, we shall begin the training. Oh, what do we have here? Yuritsa wants to visit. Yeah, sure, why not? Let's see what Yuritsa has to say. Stoic as always, I see. What's the matter? Not hungry? What is that? Oh, I that actually looks pretty good. Some sweet delights. Is there a problem? You have a sweet tooth? Yes. That's surprising. I am a person actually. too. What I eat is nobody's business but my own. If you need something, spit it out. My ice cream is melting. <laughs> um... I came to see if you join me for some training. Perhaps after I finish devouring this treat. <sighs> he is really liking whatever that is. Are you really the Death Knight? I am. And I am not. Oh, he's going to give At us some moment, philosophical answer, isn't he? I am Yuritsa von Hrim. The Emperor and the army know me only as the Death Knight. But he is merely an illusion. A demon who resides in my heart. He is not me. Not who I am at my core. He thrives and feasts upon blood. Death. Suffering. So while I sit here eating, I prefer to just be myself. Yuritsa. That's quite interesting, like actually. Who I truly am. <sighs> hmm. I am incapable of enjoying my dessert with you gawking at me like that. I have no further words for you. Go. Of course, of course. Well, that's interesting. <laughs> wow, he likes ice cream. <laughs> So that's my first time like interacting with Yuritsa, at least support wise, uh, mainly because I haven't done this this story before. And Yuritsa is actually a DLC character added on after the base game. So even if I did play through this chapter at the beginning of the game when I did, I would not have been able to use him. So there's a little fun fact. I'm getting it. All right, we got a couple skill level Practice ups. Shamir, Balthus. Looks like those were it. And we are back to 
some battles. All right, so we are going to do... We'll do your... We'll do Balthus's. We'll do Balthus's quest. Let's see how quick this is. Oh, I forgot to switch Edelgard over to Grimori. So I'm hoping we can do that before we head into battle here. Because if we can't, uh, well, that's a, that's a shame. That's a shame. But I think we'll be able to. Uh, first off, units, and then who can we remove? Hmm. We'll remove Yuritsa for Edelgard. Oh, that's right. And then we need to go to Edelgard. Reclass. We need to reclass Edelgard as a Grimori. Expert in all forms of magic. The Grimori allows you to have double of all magic, essentially. At least I believe that's what it says. Yeah, black, dark, and white magic uses times two. So, you're not running out of magic anymore. That's, uh... 20 fire, 10 Balgunan, or however that's pronounced. Even some Luna and Hades. And then if we go over here to Bernadetta, we got double the Thorin, more Blizzard, more Thunder. So that's uh, pretty good. And that's right, Petra, for I forget. Um. We need to give her a brand new battalion. What do we have available to her? She can't use, oh, uh, she can use C. We do have immortal core, but that increases attack while decreasing magic. So that's not what we want. Um. I don't know if we want that either. Oh, and we can't use those. She can give stride. That's actually not too bad. Anna's secret weapon in her eternal effort to maintain the highest profit margins. I think that's who we're going to use. Or we have Nouvelle Flyer Core, who are magic users. Oh, this is a tough one. I think we've got to use them. I think that's the best thing to do. And then Dorothea, once she comes, uh, when she's able to use a higher tier of authority, we're going to give her the stride. I think that's what we're going to do. Okay. That's been enough diddy daddling. Daddling? Diddy daddling? Is that how is it diddy diddy daddling? I don't know. It's tired. It is currently 1 a.m. the day that this is going live. I'm a little bit tired. Let's get into the battle. Let's stop Let's with uh, excuse excuses. Maybe that's the way to do it. So what do we? Oh, oh. I think they can attack from uh, all sides. So um. Yeah, this is interesting. I I'm in. think what Ready we're going anything. to do here is just shove everybody except for Leone. Oh, she can attack. I'm going to chuck a javelin at this guy. Suck it! Haha, <laughs> worth it. Yeah, we're just going to stick everybody into the forest here. Um... I think that's the best thing to do. More fighting. The reason being, they will have a harder time hitting us in the forest. I just hope Leone can uh, can tank all these. I don't know how much damage they'll... Oh. 
Well, that's concerning. They deal more damage than I thought. Oh. Uh, huh. Well, no. That wasn't good at all, was it? Huh. I honestly thought she could take a little bit more. That was not the case. So... Now, we are just gonna dismount everybody. I think Dorothea will be fine. Yeah, she won't be hit. Okay. That should be a little bit better. Yeah. Oh, yeah. There we go. Much better. Much better. Yeah, so these things are, are scary. Yeah. Oh, that's a hard hit. I mean, even this strategy of sticking everybody in the forest could fail. I mean, even with a low percent chance to hit. Aliene. Okay, good. That's good. They do a lot of damage. They do a lot more damage than I thought they were going to do. Okay. Not. Oh. Oh, Bernadetta. Well... That's, uh, that's a little sad. But yeah, they can just fly from everywhere. You see how many things we're able to attack right here? Do we want to... Let's try that. Where they? I mean, they can attack from quite a few places. My order? So let's do, let's try that. And we're just gonna skip to the end of the turn. Somehow, we were able to take them out. Uh, so what happened? What happened here? So enemy began, Petra somehow killed one. I'm assuming she got a crit. One waited. I'm assuming Petra got another crit. Somehow didn't kill Bernadetta. Didn't kill Bernadetta. Probably a crit. Didn't kill. Missed. And then it was my turn. Well, that was very interesting. Okay. Well, now. Well, well, well. That won't do anything. That however will so we'll send Anna out not with a bow not with a bow we're gonna send fire the dragon's way oh Ooh, we got a trade secret off of them perfect perfect Dorothea Ooh, this could be bad we could guarantee a hit or 80% chance to hit. 80% chance now. was a good bargain. Maybe yeah, she just has way. had the worst level ups. Only 14 strength in the end game. Okay, who else needs... Um, I'm trying to see who... Okay, Dorothea won't kill here, which should then allow Leone to get the kill. I think we'll use Tempest Lance. How about a curtsy? Oh, so close to leveling up. I will prevail. All right, we are going to win. Mr. Dragon over here. For the Empire. And then fire with Edelgard. I do not tolerate obstacles. Well, that wasn't too bad. Now we need to somehow... Let's see, there's two, four, six, seven left. And they all have ridiculously high attack stats. Okay. 
What's my Maybe strategy? we can pull one. Let's try it. We'll try pulling one with Byleth. I believe Byleth is tanky enough to withstand an attack. Yeah. Yeah, he's okay. They're moving now. Okay. Okay. So we are going to move people back. I actually want Leone right here to fight back. We'll finish this guy off well. with Byleth. And then to get some experience on Anna, I should be able to pull him back, right? Yeah. Just to get some experience on Anna, we are going to rescue Byleth, although I don't necessarily think that it is rescuing. Okay, we're still in forest here, right? Yeah, we're still in a thicket. We're still in the thick of it. Uh-oh. All right, my cat is uh, coming up to say hi. Oh, now she wants down. All right, goodbye. All right, we're going to end our turn there. Okay, good miss and a crit. I think that's what happened on turn one when they all, like, died. Just multiple crits. Multiple Ferdinand crits. Leone able to hold her own, although she's not the quickest. And I guess for some There's reason they're able to break past her defenses. But we did get a defense boost. Now they're doing one less damage. That's that's crazy. How much damage they're able to do. And we still don't have any... I really need to put on, yeah. I really need to put on some ax combat arts, but that's okay. Uh, Anna. Hmm. Yeah, we'll have Anna take this thief out with a bow. She's just kind of our all-around character. And I really want her to move again, but that's okay. Go ahead and smack this guy. He does get one hit on us, but that is a-okay. Who do we want to get this kill? Who's close to leveling up? Petra's pretty close to leveling up. Um, we'll give it to we'll give it to Petra. Since she's already there, she's now level 32. I believe she is our highest level character right now. Still no boost to magic, but more speed, more dex. She is not missing anything. Okay. Let's see how that fares. Oh, ow. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, a little scratch won't stop you. Uh, so now we just have these final two. And I think for them, we are going to have to move forward. Un well, I wouldn't say unfortunately. There are just the two left. So, we're going to push forward with all we have. Oh, that's right. What am I doing? I can mount with some of my characters. Makes it a whole lot easier to move. But I don't want them going in by themselves. Ready for anything. I'm in. Okay. Alright, good. They are moving up. Anna, 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 Anna. I guess we'll just heal up again. Not enough to level her up. I do want Anna to level up here. Um, 
no particular reason why. But we'll just let these guys move towards us. She can't kill, not even with a bow. But is that enough to level her up? It is. Perfect. Okay. Some magic, dex, and speed. And that is it. Look at how, look at how little damage. Look at how little damage she does. All right, we're going to have the Tempest Lance here. Tempest Lance to get the hit. Perfect. Send her back. And I think we'll let Dorothea get the final kill here. Uh, potentially. Let's, let's attempt a crit. We don't get a crit. Bernadetta is not the one to finish it off. That... Ah, it'll go to Byleth. We'll let Byleth end it here. Perfect. No turning back now. Fantastic. Well, that is stage complete. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and complete that final mission off screen, off recording. Uh, and then the next episode, we are going to be taking on the mission, Capturing Deer Drew. So guys, if you did enjoy today's episode of our Fire Emblem Three Houses playthrough, don't forget to hit the like button on this video. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. Thank you so much for watching this video, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.